Thank you for joining for this quick three minute overview of SmartView. Firstly, I'll open SmartView from my menu in Dynamics GP. Now, the first thing I want to look at is how fast SmartView can return data for you. If I take my list here called All Customers, it's going to return for me, as you can see at the bottom there, 10,000 customers in about two seconds. Now, this list contains 30,000. If we were to say, let's give it the maximum records and start counting, and we go two, three, four, five, I can get to six, and it's then returned to me 30,669 records straight to the screen in that amount of time, which if you compare that with SmartList, is significantly faster. I can then do some work with that, like move the columns around, and it doesn't take any longer to refresh that data. The data is going to sit there. If I wanted to add a column, I choose it from the right, and it will add it into that list straight away. Secondly, I want to look at the ability to filter this data. So if I was to filter this data, I could um, right click and click edit filter or I could pop up to here and say look we want to select particular records and let's grab these in particular cities that we want to deal with right now and it's going to go and show me the data just for that filter secondly if we edit that filter I can drop down here where I can add an unlimited number of filters so I can go forward and add as many filters as I'd like um, I can also take one of these and you look at the criteria available everything from is equal to is between is not between is like for those ones where you don't quite know the spelling is any of to give me that list um, so you've got a very wide range of filters to make sure you can get specifically the data you're after the second thing I can do with these lists and I might just grab a different list here is grouping and subtotaling if I was to take this list here again if I want to add some data all I'm doing on the right hand side is choosing that I want to add the city and the country to this list which will do it instantly adds those across on the right I can then take those fields and drop them up into the top and we're going to group and subtotal by the city if we were to take a look at that one you can see now for each country group we've got a total and the totals at the bottom are calculated for each numeric field you can then group by one or if you wanted to group by the city I can group by that as well and we'll have multiple groupings now where we can full collapse which is my favorite view and then you start looking from there at the cities inside there and then the customers that fall into that category the last thing I want to talk about is exporting now I've got the ability here to export to Excel CSV or PDF but my favorite is to cut and paste so I'm looking at this data and I might be looking at these cities I want these particular records so I'm going to highlight those use control grab these ones control copy or for those with a mouse right click and copy drop into Excel where I can control V and I've dropped all of that data straight into Excel now it's got the format right so I can auto sum and it knows that that was a number so there's no faster way to get my data straight out of SmartView into Excel so I can do my work thank you